So today I will introduce 10 different features on your Samsung Galaxy phone. And then some of the features we're gonna match what the iPhone events, you know, how what they introduce. And I can show you right now in here, there's actually some features that's already built inside and it's pretty, pretty amazing. So now let's subscribe and let's get started. So right now we're gonna go into the camera. And then when we go to the camera, make sure that you go to more. Okay, I'm gonna zoom in, you go to more. And then you will see it can be dual recording or it can be director, uh, viewer or something like that. So the newest uh, update is actually called dual recording, which means that you can record two lens at the same time. And then you can actually choose whatever the lens you want. Okay, so you can see right now, there's actually two lens happening right now. One is really, really zoom in. One is like outside right here, you can see that. In here, you can press the three dots or whatever. You can choose whatever the lens you want. Let's just say I want the, one of them is front camera. One of them is, let's say, wide angle, okay? So now you can see it's highlighted and you press OK. Now you can see one is wide angle, one is actually aiming to me. So it basically it will be recording separate videos if you press this button, okay? And that's how it works. And then if you press this button right there, I'm gonna show it to you. If you press this button right there, you can change how it looks. So up and down, right at the corner, okay? So you can see it's actually at the corner and then I'm recording myself, right? And then that's it. So this is another way of like how you want to place your lens or your screen. So iPhone did introduce this thing called center stage. Center stage is basically a camera, okay? They're gonna take a picture and your person will be in the middle. They can change that into portrait mode or landscape mode. It doesn't matter if you put your phone like this or like this, they will change it for you by using AI or I don't know how they do it. That's pretty cool. However, on our Samsung device, if you press this button, make sure you go to the video, and there's like this thing called auto framing on. You can see that. And now when you start recording, your AI will actually track your face and then move the frame. So basically they will, base, uh, they will basically put your face right in the middle of your frame and then that's it. And then you can actually do it like 4K as well with no issue. And basically you can use this as in, you know, recording. So when you stand up, you can just move around and yet the frame will actually frame your face and then auto frame and then make sure it will put in the center. Number three, I would like to show you the AI features. So let's just say we're gonna go into one of these um, videos or whatsoever. And then right now we're gonna use the AI. When you press the AI, if you scroll all the way to the side, there's like this portrait studio. Let's just say I'm gonna tap, you, you see they highlight whatever you want to do the portrait studio, right? So let's just say I want to do a 3D cartoon and generate. Now, according to that face, they will create another 3D cartoon, just whatever the uh, face is. Now, the newest update is, and I'm not sure if this apply on the One UI 7 yet, but they actually will put a same uniform, whatever you're wearing, and then they will basically create a 3D cartoon with the same uniform that you're wearing. And that's pretty, pretty awesome. So this is what I'm wearing. And then if you press generate, let's just say I want to do a comic, not 3D cartoon anymore. The comic will actually fit whatever you just wore. You can see that. On the previous version, they don't do that. They will just do whatever the face is and then that's it. But now, according, let's just say you're wearing a, like a hockey jersey, they will have a helmet and hockey jersey with the cartoon in it. That's pretty, pretty awesome. Number four, when you have like a video like this, okay, any type of videos, now you, when you hold this, it will turn into a slow mode, okay? You can see it turn into a slow mode. And then whenever you let it go, they will ask you, do you want to download that slow mode? When you press download, and now it's gonna be downloading that slow mode clip, right? And now when you go back, let's see at the front, you can see everything is in slow mode. So if you 
have any like fast motion video like what I just did and then you turn into snowball, it actually look really, really good. Okay, they did it very, very smooth. You can see that. So let's just say we would like to create a stickers on your WhatsApp. So we're gonna go in here on your WhatsApp. You're gonna press this button right there and then you're gonna press create. Once you press create, any image that you put in, they will actually crop out like a stickers. And then you can press send, and now this is a stickers, okay? And the other way is, is using your Samsung Galaxy phone. So now we're gonna go to your Samsung Galaxy keyboard, okay? Not WhatsApp, but Samsung Galaxy keyboard. You press a happy face, and now you can see there's like this blue button. You press the blue button and now you can create whatever the stickers you want. You can see that. How do I do this? It's actually quite easy. This is all customized, right? You can see that. So in Google, you can create any type of stickers you want. Let's just say I want the iPhone 17 stickers on my Samsung Galaxy device. So let's just say this time I want the blue color as in the sticker. All I have to do is yeah, go from the side. Usually, you know, you have a sidebar here. Go to AI Select. And now you just circle whatever you want. And then just basically you want to like go like this. And now you need to hold the image. And then save as stickers, you can see that. Once you press this, make sure you look down and see which one do you like to have. I would say vintage, cuddle, uh, outline, maybe an outline, right? A little bit thinner, right? Cuddle is a little bit thicker. So when I press that, you can see the iPhone become a sticker for you. And now if you go into your Galaxy phone, go into your Samsung keyboard and press a happy face and press this blue button there. Now you can see send as stickers. And then dun -dun, that is your stickers. Let's just say I have a thumb thumbnail like this. All right. And I want to add the arrow. And I want to use a 3D arrow. Guess what? If you have a Samsung Galaxy device, go to Google and you want exactly 3D arrow, right? Sure. You tap 3D arrow, press image. You can see these are 3D arrow. So let's just say I want this. All you have to do is go to AI Select. Same thing what I did just now, the, the latest trick. And then now you hold this. Make sure to not tap this anymore. Tap download. And now they actually clip off from the background. Now you go back in, you press gallery. Now you will have your 3D arrow just like that. You can see that. Okay, turn and then just like that. So make it more simpler, easier, blah, 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 blah. And now this is your 3D arrow. So you can put anything you want from Google, crop it off from the background, and you can paste it any picture you want. Let's just say if you have a, let's just say you have a text message like this, and you might like, oh, like what is this meaning? Let's just say for example, right? Did you know that if you press this, and then if you highlight, bring to your home, blah, blah ha, 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 ha. And the AI will actually analyze the whole passage for you. Are they happy? Are they what they're trying to say? They will analyze the whole thing for you. You can see that. So break down, okay? Preco suggestion with a playful tone, right? They, they basically analyze the whole sentences for you. So sometimes if you don't understand if they are uh, joking around or things like that, you can actually circle to search and just highlight it and then the AI overall will analyze the tone for you, everything. And that's pretty, pretty fun. Now, let's just say, now you, let's just say you have a video like this. You go to AI Select. You circle the video. Okay, it doesn't matter what size do you want. And now you can see this, right? Now, I'm gonna show it to you. If you press a three dot, you can create a GIF. Okay, G-I-F. When you press this, and now it's gonna be creating a GIF, just like that. 
And now you can press stop. Now this is going to be your chip. You're going to press download. And now if you want to just send it, go to WhatsApp, go to photos, go to GIF, and then that's it. This is your GIF. So I'm going to teach you two more tricks that's actually pretty awesome. So let's just say if you want just a wallpaper, but you don't want this thing in the middle. So did you know that you can actually do this by using the AI from Samsung Galaxy phone? So let's just say I download that already, ready to go. And now I'm going to take this Nike out. Okay, just do it. But I want the background. You just need to use the AI and then circle whatever this is. Erase. And now when you press generate, the Samsung Galaxy AI can take out whatever, doesn't matter if it's a watermark or whatever, they can take out the, even the watermark out and then that's it. They will actually create another image and then you can use this background to do anything you want. That's pretty awesome because every single time when I want something, let's say a background or wallpaper, there's always this like tiny little watermark. Now you can use the AI just to erase it. Simple, easy. One last thing, if you have picture like this, like a wine, and you want to look at the review, just basically hold your circle to search, circle this, I'm pretty sure they will tell you what this is, okay? And then you can say review, and then they will give you the review of that wine. Cool, huh? So you might say like, oh, there's a picture of wine, I want to see what this is. This is how you do it, pretty awesome. Okay, so make sure that every time when you see something that you like, make sure that just circle to search and then uh, you were able to find what that object is. Okay, let's say circle to search, right? And then now they were able to find you whatever this is. Pretty cool, huh? Please subscribe my channel and share this video. These are the 10 different tricks on your Samsung Galaxy phone. And you might know everything, you might know some of them, but please subscribe and share to your friend. I will see you next time. Bye-bye, peace out.